In this session, let us discuss about extraction of gold from e-waste. First, let us see the principle. It is the type of hydrometallurgical method of recycling the e-waste. As we know, gold is highly non-reactive material. It is easier to recover the gold from complex mixture by the series of chemical and physical process. Now let us see the experimental procedure. The first step is collection and segregation of e-waste. So here collecting the e-waste and segregating the e-waste into different parts such as computer motherboards, cell phones and so on. Second step is physical separation. In this step, physical separation of e-waste takes place like plastics, metals and glasses. Next step is leaching. Leaching is the core step in hydrometallurgy. It is a process of dissolving the metals from ores, concentrates and recycled the material into a liquid solution. This is typically done by using acids or bases. The type of the leaching agent used depends on the metals that need to be extracted. So here, in order to extract the gold from e-waste, aqua regia leaching agent is used to dissolve the gold. Aqua regia is the mixture of hydrochloric acid and the nitric acid. So when gold involved e-waste is mixed with the nitric acid and hydrochloric acid, the formation of chlorooric acid is takes place along with nitrogen oxide and water. This is leaching step. Next step is precipitation. Here, the gold is precipitated out from the solution of chlorooric acid when chlorooric acid is treated with suitable reducing agent like sodium metabisulfite. So when chlorooric acid is treated with the sodium metabisulfite and water, the gold is precipitated out from this solution and the formation of sulfur dioxide takes place along with sodium sulfate and hydrochloric acid. This is precipitation step. Next step is purification step. Here, in order to improve the quality of gold as well as to remove the impurities, uh, if any, the precipitated gold is purified using ion exchange method or distillation method. And finally, the purified gold is recovered for reuse. Now, let us see some of the advantages of this method. By using this method, we can expect high yield result. Also, by using this method, we can extract the gold very rapidly. These are some of the advantages of this method. Next, let us see some of the disadvantages of this method. In this method, uh, so many chemicals are used. This is one of the drawback of this method. One more disadvantage is, if acid residues are not disposed properly, uh, then which may harm the environment. These are some of the disadvantages of this method. 